What's up, guys? Welcome to local band Smokeout. Smokeout. Any genre from, from anywhere in the entire world. I, I want to hear your music. I said, ladies and gentlemen, Idol yeah, Kings! Hell yeah! Yeah. Yes! Yeah. Dale, Rob, I appreciate you, you uh, gentlemen joining. My co-host today is my buddy Mojo. He also goes by Encircled Throne. He's a, he's our my co-host today. He's an awesome dude. But really quick, Rob, Dale, if you guys could please properly introduce yourself. Let me know whereabouts in the world you are right now. Plug and promote anything and everything. Well, I'm Dale. I'm the clean vocalist, and I'm in Wales, United Kingdom right now. I'm Rob, the MC from Detroit, Michigan. Normally, uh, right? Uh, do you guys want to plug anything? By the way, Rob, do you want to plug anything? Uh, well, not yet. Not, yet. not right now. Okay, <laughs> not yet. No, we'll do, do, do. We'll do it during the tortures, during the tortures and the trivia and the hot sauce and all that stuff. <laughs> really quick, before we dive into all the questions, I, I normally have like the band's Spotify pulled up in in this uh, area of the screen that you guys can see. But I'm sure you're well aware. We go to the Spotify. It looks like this. What what is uh, what's going on on this part? I would like to start there. We're Absolutely. working out we're a, just yet. <laughs> yeah, we're working out a deal with somebody right now, so we can't have anything up. A deal, you say? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Oh, I know exactly what that means. I'm rooting for you guys. Good luck. Hell yeah. How how yeah. Dale did you meet Rob? Being that you guys are so far apart. It was actually through you, BG. <laughs> Really? Without you even knowing it. Yeah, you reviewed my song ah. Vulnerable and then their manager hit me up on Instagram and they were like, we like you and we want you kind of thing. <laughs> Dude, that's awesome. Hell yeah. That's all because a, of you. That is amazing. <laughs> well, well, I, I send love. That is that is wicked cool. Um, well, I have I have 100 questions, but uh, Mojo, do you do you want to fire off one or two? This is one I think needs to get asked more. How did you learn about local bands Smoke Out? I learned through, uh, you know, Christian O'Neill from Chemical Youth. Absolutely. Yeah, yeah he, 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 he hit me up and told me about you guys. So <laughs> and how that's how you, I found you. And how did you meet Christian? I know you guys work together and, and have done, uh, you know, uh, uh, projects and stuff but or, or singles. But how did you first meet Christian? I met Christian through a group on Facebook called Chango. Are you aware of Chango? Chango, C-H-A-N-G-O? Yeah, it's like a group full, filled with like musicians and people who uh, basically want to sell you their songs or they want to do artwork for you or streaming videos and stuff like that. So it's kind of so like Christian, an Etsy for musicians, essentially? Yeah, pretty much, yeah. Oh. Christian was in that group and I needed help with songwriting on a song, so loads of people were like recommending him to me. So Hell yeah, that is, that's badass. No, I've never heard of Chango. Uh, uh, Throne, did you have one more? You can go ahead, Rob. Who, what MC inspired you just to just to want to start spitting in general? Uh, probably Tupac and Bone. Really, I've seen Bone yeah. live, and I would I would I would kill to see Tupac uh, live, but uh, obviously not possible. But yeah, Bone Bone Thugs for real. Um, I never always... I never got to see him live, but I've always wanted to. I saw him at a weed festival like two or three years ago, and, and, and the, it was fantastic. They, I at that festival, I had backstage passes, so I was like five feet away from when they were walking up on stage, and uh, they were burning. It was cool. I see you got some. What is that? WWE belts in the background right there? Yeah, they're, they're actually my sons. I had nowhere else to do this because it's loud as shit. So I came in here. <laughs> they're, they're your sons. Who who's his favorite wrestler? Uh, oh man. Probably, I think it's John Cena, to be honest with you, and Seth Rollins. Rollins? Seth Rollins. Okay, cool. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> We're like, oh, we, we don't see what you're saying right now, but uh, mm -hmm. hell yeah. And then, and then Dale, same question regarding uh, doing vocals. Like, when when did you find yourself just kind of, you know, singing in the car as loud as you can to a certain band? Or, or who made you just want to experiment with your voice? Um. So no, I've I've, had, I've got quite a few uh, inspirational people, uh, but Ronnie Radke falling in reverse for me is probably the main one. But the first like 
where I found my voice was when I was actually singing along to the City of Evil album by Avenged Sevenfold. <laughs> really? Yeah, I liked his raspiness, so I was trying to trying to implement that into my style. And you, yeah. I don't think you have any raspiness, but you found like a cool, unique, high pitched tone niche that that is perfect. Yeah, my voice so. has developed a bit since then. <laughs> <laughs> Hell yeah. Uh, how does how does uh, walk me through how an Idol King song starts from from beginning to end? Like where where does the beat come <laughs> from, or the or the instrument instruments? And then do you get it first, Rob? Do you get it first, Dale? Do you go back and forth? Like what's the process? Yeah, both it's of it's kind really, of sporadic. It? Yeah, it's kind yeah. of sporadic. Hey, I got the song. Here you go. Okay, and then within a day, it's done. A yeah. day. A yeah. day. <laughs> it's all DIY, in-house, mixing, mastering, all that stuff? Yeah, Rob does all the mixing and mastering. Dude, you kill it, bro. It's every every jam is Appreciate fantastic. It. And then what? what's the full story about Idol Kings before Idol Kings with a different do you name? Remember, <laughs> do you remember, uh, you actually interviewed me before. Do you remember I Am Trouble? Yeah, I was going to say, you kind of look familiar, and I remember I Am Trouble for yeah. sure. How long ago was that? That must have been a while ago. Uh, 10 years? Ten I think years. 10 years ago is when we started. You are think... old, Rob, I'm just saying. I, I, Wait, I that's know. that's not how long ago I interviewed you, though. No. Oh, okay, okay, so I was like, dang, 10 years ago. No, but how long I'm did trying we... to, I'm trying to piece it together, like, when it was. Probably, that, it had to have been a year or two ago. Okay, cool. Maybe three. Hell yeah. Well, uh, uh, I know Mojo has another one or two, and I'm going to let him ask that, but did you guys bring the hot sauce? No. That's okay. We Dale, he, Dale, Dale he, he's what, got this part covered. What sauce did you bring? Can we can you, can we see what it is? I, 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 um, it's the only one I had in the house, but it's a Nando's Peri Peri, and it's only medium, but I don't do spice, so it's going to fuck me <laughs> up. <laughs> do, do you guys have an idea on on what movie or TV show you want, you want to roll with as far as what I'm looking up trivia on? Star Wars, I don't know. I wouldn't go. Yeah, I probably wouldn't do it. You're screwed, Dale. I don't watch TV. I don't watch anything. <laughs> Star Wars it is, then. Is there a particular Star Wars you want me to pick from? A particular episode? Revenge of the Sith, probably. Okay. Mojo, shoot off some more questions. Let me let me look up some Sith some Sith trivia. Um, I saw this on the <laughs> Facebook when you were posting about how did you hear of Idol King's and I assume that I Am Trouble Facebook turned into Idol Kings. So yeah. that was all all you at first. And then you found him and y'all just morphed it into Idol Kings, I'm guessing. Yep. Yeah, it's um, like a whole rebranding thing you were going through, wasn't it? Yeah, and it, it came about really quick. Like, I think from the time um, Tim, my manager, hit up Dale to the time that we actually started working with. I think we had our first song done in a week of meeting each other. It was less than that. <laughs> was it? Yeah, it was about... I got binge sent to you within a day. Do you feel oh, like... Yeah. Yeah, do you guys true. feel like the response for, for for all the music you've been putting out for Idol Kings is, is um, you know, mostly positive, but also simultaneously, like, pushing you to kind of focus on this project more than just being a side hobby, I guess I'd say? Because everybody that I've shown you guys to is just like, holy shit, this is awesome. <laughs> oh, yeah, we just kind of do it at our own pace, really. Yeah. I, 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 it's not, I wouldn't say it's a side hobby because we got some pretty major stuff coming. Right. I, I didn't mean side hobby. I'm saying like more like to take it as like a full time as opposed to a side oh, yeah, hobby yeah. is what I mean. Yeah, yeah, ab yeah absolutely. Hell yeah. And if I, that was going to be one of my questions, Um, like... I assume y'all are eventually going to want to play shows and stuff, although you're in across the pond here. Um, this summer. When when y'all get together, are we going to do, are we going to find a full band, or are we just going to do the MC route and have it played through the PA and stuff, and y'all two are just going to do your thing? Well, if we can get something, we, we plan to do our first show this summer, just to kind of mm -hmm. work everything out, get our chemistry together. And then we're talking about maybe a mini tour over where he's from, and putting together something a uh, full band okay so it's a uk little little run yep have you ever been a bit over there rob would that be your first time i dude i've never even been on a plane really <laughs> <laughs> yeah okay cool drama drama mean for sure so you don't so you don't get sick i would recommend 
But uh, well, let's... I'm gonna need more than drama beam. <laughs> let's try <it. laughs> a little booze or something. Uh, I brought some. I've I've got some hot sauce from Hell Devil's Revenge as my uh, my hot sauce that I'm bringing, and it's it's not too too bad, but it's got some spice. But I do have my first question here regarding Revenge of the Sith. Here we go, Dale. You got to pick. So I'm counting on you. What is the name of the other Jedi besides Yoda, who is on the planet of Kashyyyk? K A S H Y Y Y K. Kashyyyk. There is another Jedi on the planet besides Yoda. Oh shit. <laughs> <laughs> I'll give you a hint. His name starts with an L. I've gone blank. I literally watched it yesterday. You were you were preparing. I was. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> No, it's gone. The race. <laughs> well, that is the stump. It's Luminara Unduli. <laughs> Cheers. I'll do some. I'll do some hot sauce with you, regardless. But um, sounds like a cool album name. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Luminara Unduli. Are you still doing Trouble, Rob, or or not so much anymore? No, no, it's Idol Kings. Gotcha. Full time. <laughs> Mojo, that's what I'm. My mouth's on fire. That's not good. <laughs> How you, you doing okay, Dale? Or is it because you don't like spice? You said I don't like spice. No. <laughs> go ahead and go ahead and plug plug something now while while you're while you're on fire. While I'm numb. <laughs> yeah, yeah. That's fine. <laughs> Rob, what do you want to plug? Uh, probably the YouTube. That's seeing that's all we really can have, have right now. Yeah. So yeah, go to our YouTube, uh, Idol Kings. You'll see all our songs there. There are more on the way, which I'm really excited about. One I think you're gonna Instagram. like. I, I was curious. Maybe about the Instagram. Just gonna keep doing the. Oh, the Instagram, yeah, Idol Kings official. Everything's like Idol Kings official. If you can find us Facebook, Instagram, YouTube. But music-wise, I think it's just YouTube right now. I think it's just YouTube at the minute. Yeah. yeah. Is it was there any other uh considerations for a band name that didn't make it before you selected Idol Kings? Do you recall? Oh it's it's actually a long story. I had another singer actually before Dale and it, it just didn't work out. But Idol Kings, that's where Idol Kings, the name came from. And gotcha. then when that didn't work out, I really wanted this project to be something. And I think that's when Tim hit Dale up. And Tim, then Tim showed me him, and I'm like, there's no way this guy's going to work with this. And <laughs> the next day, I'm sending him a song. So, yeah, he didn't even have a, a choice in the name. The magic was meant to be. The magic yeah. was meant to be. Um, once the... I, I know you can't say a lot, but when... Could we anticipate all the songs being back on the streaming sites Yeah. in a month or two? Probably. Maybe less. Probably. Yeah, maybe a week or two. Okay, a week awesome. or two, yeah. Awesome, hell yeah. So we'll move swiftly on that. That's cool. Uh, I, I'm going to look up one more trivia, but uh, I want to ask um, when uh, do you guys have? I love to ask people if they have any phobias or fears. Do, what what freaks you guys out? What scares you? Deep water. I hate the ocean. Anything to do with being in deep water. Fair enough. I'm kind of the same yeah. if unless I'm on like a massive boat. Yeah, even in a boat, I'm still thinking like there's a giant seaweed monster down there that's trying to get me. Yeah. <laughs> oh, get me. Cruises are out of the question. <laughs> yeah, yeah. What What about you, Dale? I think I'm Dale does cameras. What is? Oh. What is? Hammers? I said I think. No, no cameras. Cam cameras. <laughs> oh. <laughs> No, oh, yeah, cameras and heights, which is really funny considering I'm six foot four. <laughs> when you say cameras, what do you mean? Like, like, like we're shooting a music video and you kind of like freaked out that the camera's all on your face? I, I just don't like uh, my photo taken or any videos. I don't mind doing it, but I won't watch it back. Uh, I just, was there something that happened a long time ago or is it just kind of? I'm, ju I'm just very self-conscious. <laughs> For sure. It, you know. It is what it is. It's all good. I feel, uh, I feel that. I don't, I don't care for pictures being taken either. 
I, I'm one of those people that, like, when I'm, like, my wife always yells at me. She's like, you never take pictures. You Like, I never take out my phone and, like, take pictures of anything. She's always yelling at me about that. But uh, I'm kind of weird about pictures, too. Like, I'll take a pictures, but I've never am the one, like, doing all that. But I want to I wanna try and stump you one more time, Dale. So here we go. Okay. Now, this, this one, since you got the first one wrong, this one's a little bit easier, I think. Especially since you watched it yesterday. In Revenge of the Sith, what character has the last spoken line in the movie right at the end um obi-wan enjoy the hot sauce my friend <laughs> <laughs> it is c3po he says oh no and then the then the trailer then the credits come i hate this shit <laughs> <laughs> we got him again hell yeah um so after after all the you know stuff that's coming is done and i know we talked about the the mini run in the uk and then you said dale that you are going to be going to to michigan also at some point yeah in the summer and then is that you said there was a small mini run for that and what part of michigan are we talking about uh what michigan mean? Like, what, like show like the show wise like like yeah. to, i'm just curious like or what like, city because we are you and are you looking for band members? Uh, kind of, but not yet. Okay, pra- we, we know a bunch of people in the Detroit part. area. If that helps, like if if you if you need us to you know recommend a bassist or, or drummer or something along the lines of that, and even if it doesn't work out, oh, yeah. you know. Yeah, for sure. All right, cool. I think a live band would be cool when we like start playing bigger shows. Yeah. Yeah, it would be wicked cool. Um, Mojo, uh, a couple more questions for me. Um, I don't know if y'all can necessarily talk about this, but I noticed we're doing we're doing the single rat right now. Are they actually? Are you actually going to do an album with all these, or are we just going to enjoy dropping the singles and not worry about an album? <laughs> we just had this argument, but yeah, it'll be a full album. Yeah, it's good. <laughs> in in twenty twenty four, I I imagine so because you guys are so fast and how how quick you can put out a song. Oh yeah. Yeah, Rob doesn't like the single route. <laughs> no, nah, I'm old school, man. I was doesn't like EPs, the band, just like full album. Uh, they all have like their, like they all have their reason of why they exist, and and certain things work. But at the same time, like I, I kind of agree with Rob. Like the traditional full album experience is like you kind of just can't get that from a four song, five song EP. Like sit back yeah. for an hour and just you know soak it all in, kind of thing. But, um, especially, especially with the, the, the kind of album that binges, you know, it's like everybody glorifies addiction and drugs and party. And this is kind of like, if you listen to it, it's like the darker side, almost telling a story. Like you got the binge, you got the dream state, the ups, the downs. So to try to wrap it up in six songs would make no sense. Yeah. Can we, can we anticipate more, more features, like more guest appearances in the future? Yeah, we, yeah, you can anticipate, it, but we can't say nothing. I got you. No, I understand. I know. <laughs> it's all. It's all. I wish I could, man, because it's 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 huge. Cool. Hell That's yeah, awesome. that is wicked awesome. It's uh, huge. <laughs> Dale, what's what's your what's your favorite? Uh, as someone that's never been to the UK, what's your favorite munchy meal? Oh, um, I like steak a lot. Probably my favorite. How do you get your steak cooked? Uh, medium rare. That's Good the way, man. That's the way to go. <laughs> that's 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 the only way. As a chef, that is the only way. <laughs> oh, so you're a chef also? Yeah, yeah. What kind of restaurant? I, well, I'm currently in a hotel, so I'm cooking for everybody at the minute. That's cool. It probably the days probably go fast though, because you're probably super busy. I would imagine. Yeah, and I burnt myself today, so it's a lot of. Don't let him He's he's on the <laughs> phone all day texting me. Did you get the mix done? Is it done? Is it done? <laughs> over there, over there, flipping it. Like, Hold on now. <laughs> yeah. Rob, same question. Uh, go to go to munchie meal. Uh, Everything. Munchie meal, or like, like a dinner. Let's say. Well, look, I guess two. You could. Yeah. To me, uh, dinner and munchie meal when it's you know after a night of partying or something. But you get uh, definitely, the show. definitely steak. Exactly what Dale said. Cool. Munchies, munchies, got, gotta be chips, any kind of chips. 
Love You'd it. think we were brothers, wouldn't you? Yeah, you, <laughs> are, you are very similar. That's cool. I'm a I'm a big uh, Cool Ranch Doritos guy. Yes. Ooh, yeah. I wish I could just Flaming buy the seasoning and just put the seasoning on other things like the. <laughs> that would be awesome. Uh, so, have you ever tried? Have you ever tried it with uh, cream cheese? Philadelphia cream cheese. Like a Cool Ranch Dorito. Yeah. No, yeah, nice. but I'm going yeah, to. You got, yeah, you got to try it for sure. Have you ever tried an Oreo in cream cheese? Ew. Yeah. No. no I <laughs> it's amazing. No. <laughs> it's amazing. Tried, it, um, it tastes like cheesecake. I tried a... Uh, shit. Uh, uh, what do they call it? A nutty butter or something? A nutty butter something? Yeah, a nutter butter. I don't, it, yeah, I dipped that in cream cheese, and that was somehow really good. What's a nutty butter? Like a chocolate candy. It's an American thing. Oh. Or no, is that is that the the cookie with the peanut butter in it? Like the like... no, it's like a it's like a long wafer thing with yeah. chocolate on each side. Yeah, that thing. Okay. That's called a Twix here in the UK. <laughs> we got Twix. It's not Twix. Yeah, we got, we got Twixes. <laughs> Yeah, the <laughs> Oreo and sour cream, though, it was a torture that I had to do once. And I'm telling you, like, I eat that not all the time, but if, if it's just sitting right there in the, you know, the Oreos and the sour cream in the fridge, it tastes like cheesecake. I don't know why. The two the two combined just make a most excellent flavoring dessert. I highly recommend it. Highly recommend it. Dale, do you have any unusual vocal warm up techniques or tricks that you do? I don't actually warm up. It's pretty bad. I just drink a hot tea and then I go for it. <laughs> That's cool. I probably should though because I'll lose my voice eventually. <laughs> well, we don't want that. And is it same yeah. the same for like screaming and everything too? Just the hot tea? Same. Yeah. Yeah. I just I'll just listen to the to the beat. I don't even write lyrics really. I just listen to it and I freestyle half the songs. That's awesome. You just, and what what like DAW, dream state was all a was all a freestyle. Do you guys use the same DAW system and, and for like transferring back and forth files or completely different? Like one you use is Logic, one you use Pro Tools. What do you we both use? Both? Studio One, but we don't Studio actually one, yeah. we don't send our like actual. Um, I, I I I mix down all the stems and then I email them over and he'll mix them. Gotcha. Cool. He's really fast with it as well. He'll do it in a couple of hours and then I'll get a drive link and boom, song done. <laughs> That's the best when you're like in the zone, just working and, and you know, hitting all the plugins and VSTs. After, What's up? See, after you get got the first one down, it's probably easy just to plug his vocals in now. He's already got the template sitting there. Yeah. No, it, it cha his, his voice, his range is, it changes on almost every song. So like most of the compressors stay the same, but like the EQs, yeah, man, I want to break my computer sometimes. I'm a nightmare <laughs> for you, aren't I, Rob? <laughs> Hell yeah! Well, is there is there anything that we did not touch on today, fellas, that you, that you guys would like to be brought up and chatted about, or one last chance to promote anything? Yeah, no, dude, our hands are tied right now. It sucks. I get it. There's so much I'd look, like to say, but. <laughs> Yeah. I, I feel like I, we feel like you guys are really close to winning a tournament too. You've gotten like right there at the very I end, man. Got to the final. <laughs> it's 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 probably gonna happen sometime in the near future. I would I would guess. But uh, Rob was happy to to knock out Sleep Theory, weren't you, Rob? <laughs> yeah, I thought that was pretty crazy. I, I didn't yeah, think we stood a chance. chance. Yeah, that band was. Uh, I mean, they're fairly big too, so it's always cool to knock yeah. off like a, a bigger, bigger artist or band. Hell yeah! Um, well, all right. Well, Mojo, you want to send them out on, on a final thought, final question? What's your favorite in Circle Throne song? Oh, um... <laughs> <laughs> probably the latest one. <laughs> it's a good answer. It's a safe answer. It's a good answer. <laughs> Hell yeah! What what time is it over there in in, uh, in the UK, Dale? Uh, it's twenty past twelve in the morning right now. That's that's a sleepy time. Yeah, sleepy time. Well, thank you for for doing this. We appreciate it. If it's okay with you guys, we'll we'll throw this on on YouTube tomorrow morning, and I'll, I'll send the link over tonight. Is that that cool? Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. Thanks oh, yeah. for having us, BG. Oh, it was my pleasure. Yeah, you. You, you guys appreciate keep doing it. your thing. Four, I say four for four in my book as far as singles go. Um, I'm excited to hear the news of what's going on. 
with uh you know the the big news coming soon i'm sure you'll let us her, let everybody know when it's time but we're rooting for you guys man we, we really appreciate, appreciate your support it. shout out to your appreciate manager you. uh tim correct tim yes tim. appreciate tim helping us set this up so thank you tim and uh, gentlemen have a most excellent morning slash rest of your evening and uh like i said i'll send over the link later late tonight uh so we can get that cracking for tomorrow morning Sounds good. Dale it, yeah. and Rob, a vital yeah, case. Hell yeah! yeah. <laughs> Appreciate it, guys. Thank you, guys. Appreciate it. Cheers. <laughs>